So, uh, what do you see in the future for Burma? It's a bit difficult to say right now because we are in such a nascent state of development. What I'm seeing right now is that as we open up, everyone is becoming more aware of our issues. For example, people are noticing that the Kachin War has broken out in the North, and ethnic groups in the West are fighting too. Uh, well, when I look around here in Burma, it is interesting to see the cultural strength that bonds the people together. Uh, there's something unique about this culture that keeps the people bonded together and prevents the nation from falling apart. Now, what do you see, uh, what are the positive results that you see of this uh, government reform? What I'm seeing with this reform right now is that much of, many of our people are starting to broaden their perspectives and are becoming more accustomed to the different things occurring in the world. Well, that's wonderful. And I hope we only spread the positive aspects of the Western culture to this unique place of yours. Me too, Mr. President. Thank you very much. Thank you. Famous for the Pindia limestone cave, where there are thousands of Buddha images. Tourists 
killer for hiking, bird watching, and exploring ancient caves. The next ethnic group, Kenya. Kenya has the most interesting group called the Padang group, which is known as the Long Neck Woman. The Padang woman wore a brass necklace over the years, the coil is replaced by a longer one. The girls start wearing the rings at the age of five, as you can see in the picture. And last but not least, Burmese people are the major ethnic groups. They live in many different divisions of Myanmar along other ethnic groups. Traditional Burmese clothes are called Omji, a type of sarong. The men wear the sew and the women wear the man. They're not only seen in the Burmese ethnic groups, but also in other Burmese ethnic groups.
announce our play, which reflects the theme of this dinner, Burma Meets the West. There are a lot of changes happening in, in Burma right now, and this play will reflect them from a daily life perspective. So please welcome our <coughs> actors and actresses on stage.
I'm glad it's 5 a.m. this day, but I'm not going to sleep again. 